Marvin Jones here coming over in the offseason back to Detroit. Finished wide receiver 57, 46 targets, 81 yards, 529 in the yards, three touchdowns, average of 5.1 targets per game. Thoughts on Marvin Jones? I think he's a wide receiver three, but I wouldn't be surprised to see him finish just inside the top 40 by the time the season's said and done with. He he is going to be the beneficiary of Amon, Amon Ross St. Brown and and – coverage continuing to kind of get shifted over a little bit so more often than not marvin jones is going to see a little bit of off coverage he's a little bit taller right so he's able to uh be a red zone presence and the, the dude is a consummate professional right he runs solid routes he understands what his assignment is on every single play he will chip in when run blocking like he fits what dan campbell wants after um you know leaving the lions and now coming back. But I think that I think that he's a piece that it, again, he's a depth piece for wide receiver. Um, I wouldn't call him a handcuff necessarily, but I do think he's a guy that warrants being drafted, you know, anywhere between wide receiver 50 and 55, you know, I think, so there's a little bit of value there, injury potential uh, elsewhere on the team that leads to a bigger target share. So, there's a little bit of upside. What I'm seeing here, he's basically going undrafted, right? That's that's kind of where we're at here. Uh, so, yeah, I think he's going undrafted, which means, you know, you, you can build that out or take a last round flyer on him uh, and then hope for that benefit. But I, I agree with you, Kevin. I think you're going to get your return. Um, and you don't need to spend a, a ton of capital on it. Maybe a last round pick, maybe a waiver wire after the first week. Not going to be drafted in most of your leagues out there. He could be a potential spot start, potential uh, your know, depth piece for you. But this isn't a guy that you need to go out and spend much draft capital on. Uh, you know, some best ball potential there as well. Marvin Jones usually, you know, seems to always find that one or two games a season where he shows up for fantasy and, and in a best ball mm -hmm. format. He'll do all right on that one.